Well, smartphones have tracking features, but how do you use them if you don't have the phone? Jamie Tucker is here to help. No one plans to lose a phone, but it happens all the time. Maybe you left it on a table at a restaurant, maybe in a dressing room, or maybe it fell between the seats of your friend's car. You can call it, you can retrace your steps, but then what? If an iPhone's Find My is turned on, a friend can see where it is using their Find My app. Even if you're not sharing location, just open the Find My app on their phone and at the bottom you'll see Help a Friend. Enter the Apple ID and password associated with the lost device. It will show up on a map on the friend's phone, showing precisely where it is. If it's at a large store or someplace like a ballpark, they can actually zoom in on the location. They can also have it make a sound. If you fear it's been stolen, they can put it in lost mode, which lets you search for it or erase everything. But if you erase the phone, keep in mind, it won't show up on a map when you search. On Android phones, it's also simple. Just go to google.com slash android slash find and log in with your Google account on their phone. It will show up on a map of its last known location, probably where it is right then. You can play a sound on the phone, even if it's set to silent, and display a message asking that whoever picks it up to give you a call. Both Find My on iPhone and Find My device on Android uses Bluetooth signals from other devices in the area to place that device on a map, but it has to be set up ahead of time, and you can find that in settings. That's what the tech. I'm taking Tucker.